Chateau. Welcome back! Ah! <laughs> Sorry. Cheap! I caught Austin off guard there. Hi, I'm Austin. Wait, am I the human? Who are you? No, I'm not. I'm the ogre. Who are you? I think. Yeah, I'm the ogre. Who I'm Austin. Who are you? That's By the Luke. Beatles. Oh, for goodness sake, it's Lucas. That's oh, Lucas. Oh. <laughs> I thought you were trying to do like a joke. No, I said, I'm Austin. Who are you? <laughs> I'm Lucas. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. He starts. Oh, the you got him! No, that was me. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. You got him. No, You're I the was the human. Oh, you were the human. Oh, he got you. <laughs> yes. Damn. Sorry. Started it all cheap on me. Wouldn't I thought, say, I wouldn't did, say I thought name. we were on the same team. I thought we were on the same side right now. Nope. No, oh, dang sir. It. He's going in there. <gasps> he's not going in there. Maybe he's going to the store first. Of course he is. He knows what he's doing. I know. We can stop him. We as made the... him too strong. What? Didn't we just leave him on normal? Just buy a thing. Yeah, he's on normal. We should have him on easy. You're the... It's going to be super embarrassing if we lose. You're No, not super embarrassing. You're about the same level. You're exactly the same level as him. Get him with your... You have a blob. Oh. No, you had a blob. I've we got both a blob. do. I've got a blob waiting for me. I know. That's what I meant. Like, use yours. Use your traps. Oh, he killed it right away. Here All we go. All right. We can stop him. Hopefully it's a boss that we're familiar with. You're going to have to... Ex I've never been the bosses before, so you're going to have to explain it to me. A to jump in and use its power, B to jump out. Great. And you can use the power to jump out right away. Do, 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 do. Yeah, I think we can take him. And we have to because this episode's not going to yeah, be long this enough. Dragon. There's fire, ice, and poison. poison. Okay. He's like a dragon. He's the <laughs> three three types of different hydras. Like hydra, yeah. Yeah. It's like a diversified Hydra. I like the poison one, because you can splat it. Splat! Ah, he's killing us! Do we control... Oh, we control where he walks around, too. Yeah. Oh, he got ah! one of our heads! No! Oh, poison head is free! I can be poison head on its own. I'll get him. I'll go around on my... You control the big one. I'll be this little okay. guy and shoot him with some poison. Ah, oh, gosh! We're not hitting him at all. No, we are hitting him some. No, look at how much health he has. We're he's full <laughs> health. And we're almost dead. <laughs> I'm still... I'm a ghost. Why am I a ghost? Get back in. There, he's frozen. And we've hurt him a little bit. But look at our health. I know. Oh, that's it. No, it's not. Oh, he's got to kill all the heads. The separate heads. Okay, he got the body, but he's got to get the heads. Split up. <laughs> you gotta scare off this guy. He scares off when we get close to him. So if you see him pop up, you gotta go to him immediately. I've got bouncy ice. I'll scare him off. I'll scare him off. Oh, that guy. I forgot he was even here. Yeah, he heals him. He summons health for the human. Oh. So we sort of know what we're doing more now. Okay, 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 okay. And it's easier to control with the, the heads than the body. We could get out and make a blob, but... Get out of here. Come on. Die, human. Oh, no. I'm going to die. I know. I'm also, real close, too. Come over here. Help me. I have to shoot from far away. Oh, I died. You get... Make I'm blobs. Make blobs. Ah! Oh! You get us? You got us? Oh. Salvation. You got us. That's so embarrassing, because oh. we just started this episode, and now it feels like it's going to be really short. <laughs> How sad. <laughs> Look, he escaped alive. Yeah, I know. That's hard times. Boss killer, zero, one, one. Boss killer, zero, he's like a robot, too. No. Oh, man. Super sad. You ever just get sad? I get sad all the time, Austin. Oh, we unlocked, we can now turn spiders into scorpions. Good, I like scorpions <gasps> better. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Yeah, yeah, I hate spiders. They're my worst fear. Would you ever have a pet? Oh, you unlocked a new god to worship. Would you ever have a pet spider? Yeah. No, of course not. Would you ever have a pet scorpion? Would you wear a slug as a hat? <laughs> no, God. Lucas, is, I'm afraid of spiders, and Lucas is afraid of slugs. So if we're going with <laughs> I'm horrible throw, I'm hypothetical... I'm throw up if you keep talking about them, though. Well, you asked me if I'd have my worst fear as a pet. No, I mean, would you have a scorpion as a pet, not a oh. spider? No, I also would not have that. Okay. My, my father grew up in South America... 
and he, he had a tarantula and his friend had a scorpion and they decided to put them in a cage together yeah. to see what happened because the other kids and they left them overnight and they came back in the morning and both of them were dead. Oh man, so, I, my cousin had two guinea pigs and they ate each other. Oh, oh dear. Yeah, he came back and there was just like half of both of them oh. eaten in the cage. They like fought to the death and they were like missing their back halves. Oh snap. Super scary, right? I feel like the scorpion uh, stung the spider. It's, it's like it's venom. Then the spider yeah. killed the scorpion, oh, but course. then the venom acted and killed mm-hmm. it. There's no winners in that situation. Did you ever watch that show? That was like, oh yeah, like the, the Who Would Win show. Yeah, it's like and it's alligator like, versus it's like shark. Always the the anaconda wins. <laughs> it's like they're like it's fast. It's just muscles. Uh, kidding it doesn't hurt it that much it doesn't have limbs that you can damage You're like oh my god You're like it can swim so it pretty much beats sharks too <laughs> how horrible uh i love those shows i love those shows i love learning about the terror birds the giants oh, are yeah. like ostriches with like the drill peck pe- beaks should we try playing this more? Or? <laughs> do, do you guys want us to play this more? Like, comment, and subscribe like, if you want us to play this more in this episode. In the past while we're recording yeah, this. Yeah, exactly. Um, Take your time machine, go back, like, comment, subscribe on one of our old Super Mario Sunshine videos. Yeah, tell us. Because those came out earlier, so if you comment on them in the future, we'll still know about it before this comes out. In the past. That's how time works, right? Yeah, time is like a like an onion. Time is like a bad haircut. Time is like... When you, when you go, you meet your girlfriend's parents, and you're, like, trying to act normal. Me? My you're girlfriend's like, parents? Your girlfriend's parents. You're I've like, never met my girlfriend's parents. Oh, well, you should go I haven't and... even met my girlfriend. <laughs> 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 okay, so we're going to have to use more of our imaginations. Okay, so imagine <laughs> you're you. Imagine you okay. have a girlfriend. Okay. Imagine what she look like? Okay, she's sort of, she's, like, medium height. Medium she's height? Five, she's medium five, height. five. She's 5'5". Five five. That's really short. Okay, fine. She's Austin, five... she's a foot and four <laughs> inches shorter than me. You're right. She's a really tall girl. She's a high jumper okay. down at the local community she's college. Seven five. She's 7'5". Seven five. She's 7'5". Seven five. Know, we'll go with she's 6'1". She's 7'... Okay, she's 6'1". She's biochemistry major in college. Bio- oh, yeah. Fourth year. Bi- fourth year. Fourth year. Fourth, she's a fourth year. She she has, got a twenty one sixty on her SATs, which she's sort of embarrassed about because her best friend got a twenty one ninety. She has no glasses, but she, but she wears colored contacts, which she hasn't told you about yet. Oh yeah, they're just yeah. brown. Yeah, her eyes are just. But she wears the colored contacts to make her eyes. Oh no, she has blue eyes, but she wears the. Co- she's so, embarrassed for her blue eyes. Yeah, she's like I'm a freak. She's like I, I I don't want to be. I don't want to stand out in a crowd. Yeah, and she she has straight teeth, but she never had braces. She has her ears pierced. She likes to wear a small like gold straight hoop. teeth, but like if she went to an orthodontist, she'd probably they would probably be like, you probably should have braces at some point, but it's like maybe once like no one yeah. can tell that she would need braces if they're just looking, and it's like, oh, the orthodontist just wants more money so he can get like a boat. She yeah. doesn't need braces. She sort of wears her hair in one of those low side ponies that comes down over the shoulder. You think so? I yeah. think most of the time she probably wears like the double. Double braids. Double braids? <laughs> <laughs> Pippi Longstock? Yeah, double braids like um, in Frozen. Like the girl in Frozen. Okay. <laughs> I was picturing more of the other girl in Frozen's side... Side uh, braid. Yeah. Okay, okay. But brown hair, it's brown. It's sort of a mousy brown. Okay, okay, so picture her. Yes, I pictured her. Now picture her parents. Her dad, he works for... He sells insurance. Okay. And her mom... State, State Farm? Her mom... Y- Nationwide. Nationwide. Her mom, uh, sort of, um, she makes uh, candles. She's sort of. Oh, look at the commentary that we're making right now. This is how fair use works. So just to interrupt you, I'm making commentary on the game. It says insert coin, level six. Make sure you're talking about. This is the point where you would insert a coin. Yeah. Just so you know, those folks. Okay, so her mom's sort of crafty. She has, they have one of those houses, like, it's big enough that they have, like, her mom's craft room. And she, like, is. Started making candles recently. They smell sort of vanilla Right. And she's working to diversify. She's trying to get her Etsy shop off the ground, and mm-hmm. it's sort of not working. And her dad makes enough money that it's okay that she's not making... Exactly. Her mom's making money yet. Exactly. Because she had to raise the kids. Your girlfriend has a brother. His name is Terrence. And uh, Terrence Terrence is a, Malik. Terrence Malik is a sophomore <laughs> in high school, and he enjoys... Her parents really like... He's in band. He plays the clarinet. Her parents really liked... 
2001 Space Odyssey. Yeah, they did. Oh man, they named that kid they after him. They named that kid after him. That's when that movie came out. So he's a sophomore. I think that's probably actually about the right age. Yeah, and Terrence, Terrence likes you. He thinks you're pretty cool. He plays the clarinet. He's in the band. Yeah. He um, thinks he's cool, but he's not as cool as he thinks he is. No, but he thinks but he's, you're he's rich cool. in friends. Yeah, he thinks he's I'm rich cool. in friends. He has band friends or good friends. I would not as in the band. Um, <laughs> so okay, you're imagining that family. Yeah, imagining that girlfriend. And so, what was it that I was saying was like that? <laughs> I have no idea. Art life? <laughs> no, wait. But something was like an onion. <laughs> what was like an onion? <laughs> the was... past time. Oh, time. Okay. Time. <laughs> Here we go. Okay. <laughs> So, meeting that girl's parents. Time is like meeting... What's her name? Uh, her name we is... We didn't give her a name. Her brother's name is Terrence Malick. Her name is, give me a second, Nora Ephron. Yep. Okay. So, you're going to meet Nora Ephron. They have different Efron. last names because they live in a progressive house. Yeah, yeah. My my sister nannied for some people like that. Yeah. Uh, they gave both... Their their children had the same last name, but it was neither of the parents' last name. Oh, it's like Sazi. Their last name was Bird. Yeah. Uh, Lyric and Calypso... Bird. <laughs> anyway. Anyway. Um, back to the fictional people that we've just made oh, up. Oh, yes. Yeah, so, time is like going to meet Nora Ephron and Terrence Malick's parents. You get there, <laughs> and, you're, and you're... And you're trying to seem... You're trying to seem nice and pleasant, but also interesting without dominating the conversation too much. You don't want to seem right. overbearing or obnoxious. And you're trying to seem affectionate to her, but not too much... Because her dad's there. His name is Richard... Dreyfus. Richard Dreyfus. And their mom's name is... Drew Barrymore. <laughs> um, the age difference... She was named Drew Barrymore before Drew Barrymore was. She's older. Also, they live in a progressive house. <laughs> yeah. There's four last names. Yeah, and he's also a lot older than her. So, like, when... On the answering machine, it's like, Hi, you've reached the Barrymore, Dreyfus, Efron, Malik household. Yeah. We like films, leave us a message. So, time is like meeting the, the your, balancing act. Meeting Terrence is, Malik and Nora Efron's parents. Yeah. It's like that. Okay. I mean, next time on Chateau Let's Play. Next time on Chateau Let's Play, <laughs> maybe we'll play some video games. <laughs> <laughs> Some of our friends uh, don't like video games, so they just, like, they just they just listen to these videos without watching them. So this episode was right up there, Alex. Like. <laughs> All right, click on the diamond. I've been Lucas, and I've been Austin. It's All been right. a pleasure. It's been a pleasure. Goodbye. Goodbye, everyone.